I'd like to give a big thanks to Grove Made for sending this product out for review. If you've never heard of Grove Made, it's a company out of Portland, Oregon. It was established in 2009. They specialize in unique handcrafted wood products. So just know anything that you buy from Grove Made will be made by hand and specially made just for you. What's going on everybody? OT for Tech here and today we're going to be looking at a dock. For the iPhone 5, 5S, iPhone 4, 4S, it's going to have the 30 pin connector adapter as well as the lightning adapter. And we're going to go ahead and take a look at what comes inside the box. Now the first thing you're going to see is a certificate of authenticity to let you know that this is in fact a Grove made product. You're going to get an instruction booklet to let you know how to install the lightning cable or the 30 pin cable into the dock in order to charge your phone or sync your phone, whatever it is you're doing. It does not include a cable, so you're going to need to use the one that came with your phone or iPod itself. So let's go ahead and move to the dock itself. Now, when you receive this package and you go ahead and open it up and you're getting to exposing the dock, it is heavy. This dock weighs, you know, a few pounds. I mean, this is the heaviest package I've ever got in a size this small. So let's go ahead and open it up and see what comes inside. And you can see here, you do have a 30 pin adapter. Now the lightning one already comes pre-installed in the dock itself. But if you don't have an iPhone 5 or iPhone 5S or one of the newer iPods, you do have the ability to use your 30 pin charger. So you're going to be able to use your iPhone 4, iPhone 4S, or just a previous generation iPod or iPhone. So let's go ahead and take a quick look around the dock and see what we got. And you can see right here that it's actually broken into two portions. The bottom portion is actually made of steel coming in at a solid three pounds. And the top is actually a stained wood. In this case, it's walnut. And it has the Grove Made engraving right there on the front. When carrying around your dock, make sure you do not carry it by the top portion because the lid is removable. So that wood piece does come off and you don't want this thing falling on your foot. So let's go ahead and take a closer look at the top of the lid itself and you can see there's a wide opening there and that's where your iPhone or your iPod will rest when it's syncing or charging. And there's a magnet on the inside or on the bottom and that's actually going to make sure that the lid itself attaches itself good to the base. And let me tell you, the upper portion of this syncing dock or charging dock is very, very light. So all the weight is coming from that solid steel base that lets you know that you're really holding something durable and something premium and you're getting what you pay for here. If you take a look here at the charging base itself, you're going to find a piece of plastic that looks almost like scissors and it slides in and out. It actually locks into place and if you take a closer look, you can see an opening that's almost the exact measurements as the lightning connector. And in the beginning, I showed you the one that was compatible with the 30 pin connector. And this is actually going to hold your data cable in place to make sure that it's sturdy enough to support your iPod or iPhone. On the bottom of the charging base, you have four little rubber pieces, one on each corner, and that's going to allow grip and to make sure that this charging base does not scratch the surface that it's on. That little lined opening on the bottom there is actually going to hold the cable itself. That way the charging base sits flat and even and does not rock back and forth. And here's a quick look at what it looks like when it's all assembled and put together. And here's a quick look at what it looks like when it's charging your phone without a case. And you can see that space gray looks excellent with that black steel. It just looks so classy and so elegant. And I have to commend them a lot on their craftsmanship and their work when they put together this dock. Now right here, I have the Spigen Neo hybrid case on my phone and you can see it fits perfect into the dock. So that lets you know you should be able to use most of your small to medium sized cases without any difficulty whatsoever or any problems from this dock. Now your excessively large or bulky cases, you might have a difficult time fitting into the opening, but you should be able to use most of the phone cases out there. So here's the thing kids, $100 is a lot to spend on the dock, especially one that doesn't offer any special features like a built in alarm or radio or anything of that matter. But the thing is Grove Made does not try to target those kinds of people. It's targeting the people that want a very natural look with a very elegant and classy feel. And for that, I think Grove Made has knocked it out of the park and I highly recommend it if you're looking for that. Anyways guys, I hope you liked the video. Make sure you hit that like button. Do me a favor and promote company growth by subscribing. Leave me a comment in the section below. Follow me on all my social media networks. And of course, as always guys, thank you for watching and all your support.